So this is just a short video on tips for memorizing the quadratic formula because that is something that will be really helpful to you. And so tip number one is just do a lot of practice problems. The more you practice, the easier it'll be to remember. The more subconscious it'll become, you'll just be like x equals negative b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. It'll just become habit. You could also try copying it. And that it seems really mundane to just keep doing practice problems, but that's the way that you get better at anything in math. The second tip is listen to a quadratic formula song. So there are a lot of songs out there on YouTube that'll help you memorize the quadratic formula. I did a quick Google search before making the slides for this video, and on the first page of search results on YouTube, there were songs to help memorize the quadratic formula set to... There was one by, that was set to a One Direction song, Pop Goes the Weasel, Row, Row, Row Your Boat, an Adele song, Call Me Maybe. These were all tunes to which the quadratic formula was set to in a form that made it easier to memorize. And so you could listen to any one of these, or you could search for a different song, or make up a song of your own. But sometimes putting the quadratic formula into kind of a song form can make it easier to memorize. The third tip is to break the quadratic formula into chunks to memorize it. So first of all, memorize b squared minus 4ac. So just memorize b squared minus 4ac, b squared minus 4ac, b squared minus 4ac. And then add the square root over it, square root of b squared minus 4ac. And then you're going to add a plus or minus sign to the front of that, and etc. And you just keep building outwards until eventually you have the entire quadratic formula. So the fourth and final tip, I actually found this at www.csun.edu. Uh, I really liked it because uh, it's unique. And they suggest you memorize this story. There was once a negative boy who was all mixed up, so he went to a radical party. But because he was square, he lost out on four awesome chicks. So he cried his way home, and when the night was all over, it was 2 a.m. In this case, we're going to use the letter B to stand for boy. And so it says there was once a negative boy. So you start with a negative B, and he went to a radical party. So, again, out a square root here, and... Unfortunately, the story doesn't include this, but you're going to need to plus or minus sign in there. And so maybe you want to think up your own addition to the story that will help you remember to put that in. And it says because he was square, so inside this radical party you're going to add a B squared, he lost out on four awesome chicks, losing is kind of like subtraction, 4AC, so you're going to say minus 4AC, and then all over 2A because it was 2AM at the end of the story. And so... Hopefully that helped you to memorize the quadratic formula or to give you some ideas about how to go about memorizing the quadratic formula, and that's going to be it for this video.